Okay, it's February the 7th. We are in an extended length high roof transit van with the 3.5 EcoBoost. Uh, today we're getting a lot of freezing rain and this parking lot on this hill, if you can tell the grade on this hill, is notorious for being slippery at the best of times. And a rear wheel drive transit van, when it's empty, will slip and not even accelerate out of this hill. I'm gonna punch the throttle, full throttle, and check out the grip we get with a fully loaded transit van. It's pretty incredible. I have to back off, we can't go out into traffic. And we can see the traffic line coming there. You can see the weather. Ice build up on the window. Very slippery conditions. There is snow tires on the vehicle, but when it's loaded and the, the balance of weight is set out evenly, traction is just simply not an issue in the two-wheel drive transit van. Okay, one last time. I'm gonna try and safely pull into traffic here. We've got a merge going up a hill. I'm turning to the right and I have absolutely no, no issues whatsoever. I'm already up to 60 kilometers an hour and have to slow down. This customer uses this van for servicing water mains. This is again an extended length and a high roof. It's been built, we had it built with Ranger shelving. He's put in the desk, put in his own TV screen, show the customers some of the computer readings from water leak detection. And that's a quick look at what you can do with a extended length, high roof transit van. Much more user friendly than a cube van. Hold a lot of stuff and with the weight in the vehicle as I already showed you, it's incredible winter traction.